we interrupt this regularly scheduled Let's Play for an episode of Cophead, brought to you by Nathan Sevil Gaming. Let's play. And look at what we have here, ladies and gentlemen, Cuphead, a long-awaited, well, Microsoft exclusive, Xbox One and PC. Uh, I'm playing it on the Xbox One, and uh, I'm totally intrigued with this game because... Oh, stop listening. Stop listening. <laughs> oh my god. That... Well, Cuphead and his pal man, they like to roll. This is why I was excited to try this. Because it's just so beautifully done. Maybe I should just let it go. Maybe I should have just let it go. It's just so beautifully old looking and it's just it's so well done and I think they've really done with, done their, their work with this. I mean the film grain is Perfect. The sound is perfect. Even the uh, even the uh, the 1930s copyright. That's that's pretty great. Uh, let's see controls. I thought I think I had heard something about uh, a way you can actually kind of improve the controls by by changing it from the default. Uh, hmm. I'd have to watch the video for that again. But anyway, uh, I don't think we'll go too far into that. Visuals. Why would I want to change the the visuals? They're beautiful. What's it? Over... Oh, that. Oh, whoops. No, we'll put that back. Uh, brightness, color... Color blade. Yeah, no, it's... Fa it's Everything is fantastic. Um, now, what's particularly interesting to me about this is they... Uh, to get it, the, the look and feel of it being a cartoon, like, to get that just right, they actually hand-drew every single frame and then digitized it. Uh, so you really are playing an animated cartoon. It, you're, you're, you're playing a game that is a cartoon, quite literally. Um, so I, was, I don't have a whole lot of time, but I want to get at least five episodes tonight. Don't deal with the devil. Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell uh, uh, Isle, there were two brothers named Cut, Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. And... <laughs> music is perfect, by the way. Love that the kind of upbeat uh, jazz that they got going on. Um, One day, the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the elders, Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that mustache on that dice. Um, <laughs> inside Cup, inside Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves living on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog! Exclaimed King Dice, the casino's uh, sleazy manager. That uh, the hot dog thing just—it reminds me of the, the movie *It's a Wonderful Life*. Uh, if you've seen that, uh, these fellows can't lose. Um. <laughs> uh, Nice run, boys," laughed the newcomer. But brother, but the brothers gasped. Uh, it was the casino owner, the devil himself. Now, now, how about we raise the stakes? He suggested with a toothy grin. Win one more roll, and all the loot in my casino is yours. The devil boomed. But if you lose, I'll have your souls. Deal. <laughs> Cuphead, blinded with e e's rich, uh, sorry, with easy riches, uh, nodded and grabbed the the dice for a throw. Uh, good, <laughs> good gosh, Cuphead! No, cried Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes! The, the laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose! The brothers uh, trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their uh, for their very lives. There must be another way to. <laughs> I wish I could do Morty Morty's voice from Rick and Morty. Then that's exactly how that should be done. <laughs> Mugman stammered. Yes, please, Mister Cuphead said. Cuphead added. 
Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil sniggered, pulled out a uh, parchment. I have a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me, and I might just pardon you two months. Now get going. The, the, the devil roared, uh, kicking the boys out uh, most rudely. Uh, you have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls. Otherwise, I'll be the one collecting yours. Jeez, this is, this is actually kind of dark. <laughs> Cuphead and Mugman were terribly fr uh, uh, frightened and ran away as uh, fast as they could. Come on, Mug! panted Cuphead. We have to find the elder cattle. He'll know what to do. Oh, look at that loading sequence. Look at him dancing. <laughs> the animation is so good. Oh my god. Man, they, they really... You, you can just feel the amount of effort and hard work that went into this. And we haven't even, we haven't even played the game yet. You can, you can feel the amount of work that went into this. They didn't... There's no half-assing with this. And I think they were right to, uh, they were, this was delayed by quite a bit, and I think they were right to do so. <laughs> what a fine pickle you boys have gotten into. Uh, yourself, oh wait, I, sorry, I read that wrong. What a fine pickle you boys have gotten in yourselves into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, and I guess I'm doing the voice of Bane. <laughs> But if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fates. <laughs> you must play, play along for now. Collect those contracts. He actually sounds like Bane. <laughs> and you'd best be ready for some nasty business, Master Wayne. <laughs> your letter friends won't be friendly <laughs> very long once... I actually read that wrong again. Once you confront them. In fact, I expect you'll be transformed into a terrible beast. Bat-like beasts, perhaps. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. <laughs> it will give you the most remarkable magic abilities. Now, go to my writing desk and use the magic inkwell there. There's a lot of reading. Uh, you, you need to prepare yourself for a scrap. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay. Okay, cool. So it's basically like a Contra kind of thing. Which is which is all fine and good. Oh yes, the infamous tutorial. Let's see if this is confusing or not. Hold crouch to duck down. Okay. Ju um, tap jump or high jump. Okay. Um, y for dash in the air. Oh, okay. Uh, down A to descend from the platforms. Press A to shoot rapid fire. Um, right bumper to stay in place. Oh, right bumper to stay, to stay in place. Oh, okay. Um. Okay. Uh, okay, so parry slam. A press jump uh, uh, while airborne uh, to nullify or interact with pink objects. Um, this also builds your super meter. Okay, so you just... Okay, so if there's a pink thing, it acts as a double jump. Okay, makes sense. Oh, wait, is, is the idea that I can do it like three in a row? Oh, let's try that again. Oh, no, maybe you can't. Resurrect, uh, revive your dead pal with well-aimed parry. Oh, okay. Okay, um... X move. Um, an upgraded attack that uh, requires one super meter card. Oh, nice! You get a... You get a fucking Hadouken. That's sweet. Coins. Nice. Uh, stop listening. Get out of here. You're breaking the mood. Okay, well, I can't see why... I can't see why that would have been so difficult to do. I mean, I don't think... The, the whole controversy was that the gaming journalist on stage couldn't do the tutorial, which, um, yeah, probably should at least be able to do this tutorial, be somewhat gaming competent. I don't think you have to be great at video games to be able to at least to, to speak about them, but you should definitely at least be able to do that tutorial. That was actually a very well-done tutorial. 
Uh, okay, so do I just talk to him again? Talk to Bane? You have to lay, lay out all those debtors to move on. Let now shake a leg. Shake a leg, Master Wayne. I, I was born in the darkness. I wasn't raised in it. I was born in it. Uh, okay, I, I actually didn't notice if I went in the right direction or not. I'm assuming I did. Oh yeah, okay, and this is like the, the level selection world. Very cool, okay. So, I mean, I think it goes without saying that the, the it absolute mwah, A plus, A plus on the on the visuals and and the and the sound as well. It's it's perfect, perfectly well done. Uh, let's start with this half-eaten apple guy. Uh, hey fellas, look, uh, looks like I was about to do the Bane voice again. <laughs> uh, looks like you're you're in for it now, eh? Well, I used to be in uh, the same way, always getting into trouble. See, <laughs> running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer just strolling around and go, uh, going to the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand. Take this. Oh, nice. It's dangerous to go alone. Take these. Uh, four lights, run and gun. Okay. So I guess this is just how, how the mission is. So it doesn't seem entirely linear. It seems like you can kind of pick and choose the courses. And begin. Sweet. Okay. Whoa, hey. Oh, yeah, this is... Okay, yeah, this... I'm all over this. Oh! Oh, I took a hit. That's... Ooh, hey, hey, hey. Whoa, hey. I'm... T I'm... T oh, my gosh. This is a beautiful game. And... I've also heard that this game is absurdly hard, which, uh... I'm a, bit, I'm a bit of a masochist, so I'm okay with that. Holy hell! He... Okay, so I guess you can't kill some guys, or they're only brown at certain points. Death. We might have respawning enemies. Uh... Oh, wait. Maybe I can parry off that thing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, wow. Bit of a risk there. Okay, so a bit of a risk-reward system kind of thing going on there. Okay, so there's actually a lot being taught here. You died. Oh, you died. Shit, they don't give you much. Let's try that again. I mean, yeah, the controls the controls are nice. It, it feels good. You can change direction mid-air, even though that doesn't really technically makes sense, but it's, it is extremely helpful in gameplay to be able to do that. Yeah, and like it, the background really looks like, oh, oh damn, ooh, he, ooh, ooh, stay the hell away from that shit, jeez, huh, yeah. Uh, oh, so I only have one hit point left. Shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. kill him. Ooh. Okay, it's yeah, it's it's the first level, and I'm already you know I'm on my toes. It's not. Ooh. Oh, I see it's got going on here. Ooh. Yeah. Risk versus reward, bitches. Okay, things are starting to get a little hectic now. Oh, I ran off the edge by accident. Oh, I, I get... Oh, oh, right, my dash. Okay, I forgot. I forgot about my dash. Okay, let's try this again. That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you, and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game.